So let's not joke around it. Netflix did something kind of good. They did a live action that seemingly is actually good. I have not seen it yet. I will watch it and I will give you my honest opinion from someone that has never seen One Piece. Yes, I know it's a, it's a sin, it's a sacrilege. Yes, I am very aware of that. But uh, I think what best to actually put this series to the test than from someone who's never seen One Piece. So stay on the lookout for that video. Uh, but today we're going to be talking about a different movie that is going to hit our screens sometime in the near future. And that is uh, Naruto. <laughs> yes, it has been long enough that uh, we've got uh, Naruto on the screen. So here we're going to finally get him. We're going to finally get a Naruto live action adaptation. Uh, but here's the kicker, though. Here's the kicker. This movie is going to be under the production of The Witcher's scriptwriter. And not just any Witcher scriptwriter, but the one who was in charge of The Witcher Blood Origins. So, a live-action adaptation of the iconic anime manga series Naruto is currently under production by Lionsgate. The confirmation left fans excited as Daniel Richmond revealed via Patreon that Tas Tasha Hu, Tasha Hu, the scriptwriter behind the successful Netflix series The Witcher, was involved in the project. Hu, whose adept storytelling skills were evident in the well-received adaptation of The Wiccan, The Witcher, was also reportedly completed a new script draft for the upcoming live-action movie. Fans of both Naruto and The Witcher are now excited and curious about what the upcoming project will bring to the table. Let me tell you, no one is excited. Legitimately, no one is excited. Uh, no one is really excited about this because the scriptwriter for The Witcher uh, ruined The Witcher. And if you call The Witcher successful, then you clearly didn't see the numbers go down from season one to season three, especially with the nail in the coffin that is uh, The Witcher Blood Origin, which is one of the lowest rated movie series uh, that Netflix has ever produced. So I, I wouldn't say that any fan of Naruto or The Witcher is excited because clearly the scriptwriter has not done its, uh, his or her job at making something um, deserving of praise. So the first season of The Witcher was very well received for the most part, but also because Henry Cavill was um, advocating a lot for the character. So here we have Henry like changing lines here and there to make it more true to the character. And um, we all know that, sadly, um, how that turned out. So, are we excited to see The Witcher's script writer take, um, take a turn with Naruto? As a matter of fact, I am not. <laughs> but what do you guys think? Do you uh, do you guys feel excited? Do you think he he's gonna have a redemption arc where he's gonna show us that he's actually competent at his or her job? I have no idea. So hopefully, this is going to be somewhat good or somewhat uh, decent with uh, with the best of luck. So let me know what you guys think. And thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you later. Bye.